Hello everyone, nice to see you again. Today we are talking about power banks. Nowadays when we are traveling or uh, on a business trip, we will take a power bank because we don't have so many chances to charge our mobile phone on the outlet. And I know there are many people who will fall into panic when, the, when their phone is out of power. Because that's who I am. A good power bank can charge a phone several times, and that's enough for a day. And you can charge your power bank at night. However, not all of the power banks have good quality. Do you agree? Do you notice that power banks with the same mini MP hour can vary? quite a lot in terms of their performance. For example, one power bank says its capacity is 30,000 mAh, and I have a phone with 2,090 mAh capacity battery. So it can power up my phone 10 times, but actually, the power bank is out of power after three times. So that I can make sure that the capacity does not match the capacity on its technic parameters. Today I want to show you some method to measure the capacity of a power bank. First, the simplest way. Just use your power bank to charge your phone. Because you have know the capacity of your phone battery. And you can see how many times it can power up your phone from 0 to 100% power. The capacity of the power bank is equal to the capacity of the phone by charging times. In this way, you can get a rough consequence of the capacity of the power bank. The consequence is not so accurate, but it is not uh, far from the real capacity. Second. A scientific way to test the capacity of the power bank. You can use a USB tester and an electric load to discharge the power bank from 100% to 0% You can get the accurate consequence We use our USB tester. This is UM34 Insert into the power bank and insert the electric load. Set the current at 2 ampere to discharge this power bank. Press the OK button and it starts to work. Here, you can see the capacity here. If you want to test the uh, uh, new power bank, you need to you need to uh, clear the data group. Long pressed, and the, and the data is cleared. When the power bank is out of power, we can use this two way to calculate the real capacity. You can have a look at this two way.
Okay, let's start to test. Okay, we have finished the test, and uh, this power bank is out of power. We can have a look. Zero percent. Zero percent. And uh, let's check their capacity. Black power supply, uh, black power bank. The capacity is four thousand two hundred and twenty-one milliampere hour. The brown one. The capacity is five thousand and seventy six milliampere hour. And the blue one, Xiaomi power bank. The capacity is the capacity is six thousand and 200 milliampere hour. We use 5 volt as the output voltage and the battery voltage is 3.7 volt. But these two power banks, we don't know their Efficiency. We can use 90% as a reference. This one is 90%. So we can use the first way to calculate the real capacity. The first one is equal to Four thousand and two hundred twenty one milliampere hour multiply five volt 
and uh, divided by 3.7 volt divided 90 cent and the result is 6338 milliampere hour that is real capacity the yellow one is equal to 5076 milliampere hour multiplied 5 volt divided by 3.7 volt divided by 90%. The result is 7622 milliampere hour. That's is real capacity. The blue one is equal to 6202 milliampere hour multiply 5 volt divided by 3.7 volt divided by 90 percent. So its real capacity is 9312 milliampere hour. You can also use the second way to calculate their uh, real capacity. Now we can see the measurement data in this chart and we can see the technical parameters as well. According to this data, the quality of the black power bank is bad and the yellow power bank, the quality is normal but not so good. And the blue one, Xiaomi power bank, its quality is good. Okay, now we have know the method to calculate the real capacity of the power bank. If you have any advice or you have any questions, you can leave comments below the video. Thank you for watching this video.